this is Kyle from WeTech Care View, and today I'm just going to show you a quick setting on Power Apps Portal. Now I'm going to start doing some videos around these Power Apps Portals. Um, I'm just for today's one very quickly is when you've got your Power Apps Portal, uh, I'm going to show you how you can hide this register button here. So if you don't want people to be able to register for a new account on your Power Apps Portal, I'm just going to show you how you can turn that off. Now what you need to do is if you come to Power Apps, so you can see your portal in the Power Apps window. If you click the ellipsis and then if you click on settings which will open up this right panel if you then click configure the site settings so then you'll it'll take you to the uh, the portal management so you can see the site settings here now what you need to do is if you've got this sort of by name you just need to scroll down to here so authentication registration enabled so what we need to do is we need to click onto that and we just need to change this value to false so i'm just going to change this to false and i'm going to save and close Okay, so now what we want to do is if we edit our Power Apps portal. And then if you click here, sync configuration, so that'll synchronize the settings that we've just changed. And now if I browse the website, it should reload the website. Now if I select sign in. There you can see, so there you can see that's now being removed because we've set that value to false. Uh, as I said, I'm going to do a lot more videos on these Power Apps portals and hopefully show better and better and to create some nice portals. Uh, I hope this video helps. Please like and subscribe to the channel and take care. Thank you.